A peek at some of Taiwan's new combat and surveillance drone technology. Taiwan's state-owned military weapons developer unveiled five new types of indigenous military drones. Where the Taiwanese weapons developer showcased eight types of locally developed unmanned aerial vehicles, including five models that were shown to the public for the first time. The new drones come in a variety of sizes and equipped with combat or surveillance capabilities, designed for use by various branches of Taiwan's military. In response to the new global military trend, our military has been actively building capabilities. The institute has been working to develop the core technology, to fully implement the policy of national defense self-sufficiency. One of the new surveillance drones is the UAV Albatross II, which is capable of long-term surveillance and tracking of naval vessels over the sea using artificial intelligence. It is able to stay in the air continuously for 16 hours and has a maximum range of over 300 kilometers, 186 miles. Another new reconnaissance drone highlighted to journalists is the portable Cardinal 3 UAV, which is capable of vertical takeoff and landing, and is designed to monitor activities along coastlines. The main combat drone launched is the loitering munition UAV, which can be operated by a single soldier. It is equipped with a warhead and is capable of targeting individuals or vehicles from the sky. Another new type of combat drone is also designed to take advantage of GPS satellite systems and image tracking technology to launch attacks. Several indigenous military drones already in use by the Taiwanese military were also on display, including a medium-altitude long-endurance UAV capable of long-range surveillance and providing advanced air and sea warnings. The director of the institute, said the new drone was being tested by Taiwan's military and would likely enter mass production as early as the end of this year.